My grandparents used to take me here and I would get my books um, with my grandmother and then I'd go home and watch Barney. So, I already see the witches. So this isn't the right area, but I do see pagan and angels. Like I said, in most libraries, they always have the spiritual side right next to shit like the aliens. <laughs> Area 51. It's so funny. But I love the library, you guys. It's so fun. You can get lost in the books. So, I'm probably getting ready to actually go look up the books that I'm looking for. And I'll see you guys in the next video. What's up, guys? I'm going to show you a little bit of an elixir that I did for a client. Um, it's basically to make sure that their person is going to stay put. And that they're... Lusty drive is going to make them want to have sex more. So it's been soaking and curing. I have a lot of things in there. Um, for one, I have some lavender in there. I also have some chaffron, some roses. Um, there's some other ingredients in there that I'm not going to tell you about, but it's been sitting there chilling. Uh, I've been charging it with my crystals. So, this is the elixir. Let's see if I can get a side shot of the little world. It's so beautiful. What's up, y'all? I'm here pulling up at the motherfucking mall. I'm trying to give me some new shit. And I'm like, damn, for us to be muzzled and shit... And our own bacteria, we show is uh, looking like some damn experimental species. <laughs> so I'm getting ready to take you guys with me shopping. Let me turn the camera around. So everybody and they damn mama is at the mall which is shocking because everyone wants to get the fuck out of the house but wants to stay safe. Go figure. Oh, found a parking space in this bitch. Ah! Ah! There we go. I think I'm gonna pick up this uh, Givenchy perfume um, unless I find some other ones. But... I am here, baby. I have arrived. I'm not looking the best because I am. I am getting ready to revamp and change it up. So let's go see what happens. Macy's backstage. I just took some off one of these racks. What's up guys? So um, I'm getting ready to 
go to the dispensary, pick up my weed for the month. These motherfuckers would drive right. They bitch asses. Anyway, um, getting ready to go to the dispensary and I'm going to take a peek into the Botanica if it's open on this side of town. where I can get some But anyway, um, Botanica and then to the dispensary. But I think I might go to this Easy Pond. I ain't never seen this one over here, you know. So I might go into that one. I'll see you guys in the next clip. Oh, y'all got some refills? This is the new stuff that they came in with? What's the new stuff? Because I've seen... You still got that um, insomnia. That shit was nice. Insomnia something. And I can't see the names. You read up on the Obama as well as. Of course. Alright, let me smell something. Let me smell some are lemon trying, or something. Are you trying to do a 10, 11, or 13? So I know where to pull from. Um, the 13 I had was the OG that I seen y'all had last. That was, it was alright. It got kind of old quick. What is it? You know my Oh, I think I had a few of that. That was all right. Um, are you trying to get the eighth, or are you trying to get cut like two grams? Um, normally I buy like a few eighths. Um, but what's this? The lemon skunk, forty and eighth. Yeah, I like that one. I always would like that one. Let me get uh. The A for that. No, it's not. <laughs> I smoke too much and I can't keep like coming back here every two days. Um, what's the redheaded stranger shit? That one wasn't here last time. Let me get an eighth of this one. Y'all said that's a stash box? Yeah. The one I got was cool. It had like a vape in it. Some munchies. Yeah. Um, dang, you don't have that insomnia cookies no more? It was something like, it was here three days ago. I bought it. Oh man. 
There was this really like dark purple one. It wasn't the smell my finger, but it was another one that tasted really, really good. I think it was down here at the bottom. I wanna see. Um... Huh? Oh. Yeah, it was dark. It was kind of like black and purple at the same time. But it looked like smell my finger a little bit. She had me, the girl that be right here, she be having me try to shit she smoked. So. <laughs> yeah, she, she smoked a lot of tequila. Really? Yeah, I'm not a big You like indica or me just personally. hybrid me, no, corn? No, me personally indica, yeah. I don't like doing jittery. I'm already jittery. That's what I'm saying. Why do I need it more? Like, I'm, you know what I mean? I'm, yeah. I need to. I want to be able to calculate all of my high. That makes sense? That's all mental. Yeah, that, that's, that's what I want. What you yeah, that's all mental. Let me think. Was there another one that was left? It was, um, uh oh. It was at the bottom, I think. I think it was like 12 or something like that. And I really don't like the hybrids like that unless I know what it is, you know? And it's starting to all become hybrids now. Mm-hmm. Let me see what this one smell like. It look like it's called uh, the one next to smell my finger. Yeah. All right, guys, so I'm here getting ready to step into the Botanica. Hopefully, I can show you what they have, what's going on, shit like that. You know, we've been acting strange since this COVID shit. So, let's see. Botanica sign clean. Hi. Three kings, oil, okay, oil, and some um, Florida water. Florida water. The oil, I don't think so. I have. Just so I have incense. Just the incense Thank for God. three kings. Yeah. How much? Where are the incense? Okay, let me the Florida water is four ninety nine. Okay. And the three kings is right there, four ninety nine. Oh, you got sage too, okay. Mm -hmm. Mm. Okay. And this is the floor one. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, sir. I'm 
You take credit cards, right? Yes, ma'am. Bien, bien, ¿no has perdido? ¿Perdido? ¿Por qué andas perdido? No, gracias, por acá, por el cara. ¿Por qué? Andaba buscando. Es que andamos todo el tiempo. ¿Verdad? Sí. Si andas perdido soy yo, ¿verdad? Sí, sí. <risa> ya está como la del tic Estamos perdidas, perdidas. <risa> ¿Y tu papá? Bien, bien. ¿Sí? Sí, ah, bueno, anda bien. No para de caminar. Any questions you have should let me know, okay? Yeah, it says uh, nothing here is for sale. Uh, the tarot card? No, that's in my collection. That's your collection? Uh huh. Yeah. Dang. I love a tarot card. Yeah, you collect them? Yeah. You get some from overseas too? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've been looking at a lot of the ones that's, uh, well, you know, Doreen Virtue. Those are worth a lot now. Oh, okay. Because she changed. Uh -huh. Beautiful collection. Thank you.
You got some snake oil? Snake oil? Mm -hmm. uh, I didn't I'm see that. Clean, but I don't know where. I am finding. Where here is the Spanish? Oh, yeah, vibora. Say that it? again? Vibora. Vibora. Yeah, it's a snake. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's the name for it. Mm -hmm. What's up, y'all? I'm just getting up. Um, I've had a hell of a couple of days. And what's been going on in my life. Shit. Uh, hopefully I ain't got no catnip. <laughs> but. I'm probably getting ready to clean up. A bitch has kind of been on some like. Lay low type of shit. And. I really don't like expressing myself like that. But I feel like it's needed. So. Um. Listen, I'm a magician, honey, but I got feelings too. You know, human being feelings. I go through shit too. Shit happens in my life too. But I don't let it break me. I might be slow for a moment. It might take me a few days, a few weeks. I'm a Gemini now, don't forget now. To try to get over. <laughs> to try to get over shit and... You know, it just, it's amazing how miracles happen, like, in my life, like, how quick shit happens. Like, once the old cycle for me has ended, like, completely, my life completely revamps. Like, it just changes. It levels up. It steps up. Like, especially dealing with others or, like, emotions, shit like that. You just be like, damn, like, I really did, like put myself through the test and you just be like damn I accomplished this shit and that's how where I'm at right now you know and I ain't let I I ain't gonna give nobody the motherfucking spotlight uh when it's my time to shine okay that's just how I feel about it but got to a point where 
I've accepted myself in life where things don't get me down for too long. Like I've experienced a lot of death, a lot of death, you know, my parents. Um, so a lot of that shit has been trial and error and a lot of exploration too, but I don't let it get me down whatsoever. And I'll be feeling like it's always a test to see really if you're going to get your ass back up, get your ass back up again, or you're going to not stay knocked down. You know, it's like, you don't remember all them times. This is what I be saying to myself. I'll be like, so you don't remember all them times that you, you know, got knocked off your horse and you had to get back on that motherfucker, but you sure didn't know how to master that bitch and train to ride with it, okay? And that's how I'm feeling right now. So I just, I'm recuperating my life. You know, I'm blessed. I'm grateful. And I feel like no matter what I go through, no matter how many times I've been tested and tried, you know, life is life. And you just have to really keep on going with that shit. I mean, really, like, the struggles might get you hard. The friendships and the memories might delete or, you know, become slim because they're not being lived out longer but those little instances do a lot and mean a lot you know so in this vlog I'm probably gonna be showing y'all you know how it is when I transform and level up whenever I do get knocked down as a magician cause it doesn't take long at all trust me like it doesn't take uh long to bounce back okay you know when to heal or relax okay get your master plan going and shit you know get to compute and calculate and structuralizing and all that shit and then you be right back to motherfucking life back in your motherfucking mojo and I'm about to show y'all in this video you know how a magician manifests like a motherfucker so uh that's not only, you know, in the clothing hall, but it's more so me showing you what you can do to get yourself back up, you know, instant attraction, and not only instant attraction, but um, it's like, a, it's like a, a phenomenon or a miracle when I get knocked down and I come back up. Like, I want my life to be seen, okay? So, I'm going to be showing y'all that in this video. Now, I might not be able to, you know, show everything, but there you'll definitely see the transformation of what's going on in my life. Um, so, I'll see you guys. Uh, let me know what y'all think in the comments because I feel like, to put it down below in the comments, you know, what transformations you've been through in life and seeing your bounce back like I mean not that booty bouncing back but you know, you know like you're real when you were at your lowest did you see yourself at your highest or at the point that you are now you know did you see yourself there because when I think like that I'm like damn thank you ancestors I give y'all much gratitude to the ones that connect me to the right ones, okay? So let me know what y'all think in the comments down below. But I want y'all to see how a bitch manifests. Like, I just love the come up in life, the transformation, the crystal clear pictures that people give you when you down what you needed to see and how you gonna come up like straight up so i'll see y'all in the next video oh you heard that so i'm gonna go crazy my closet is so fucking messy um but i'm getting ready to 
What's up, y'all? <clears throat> I'm just getting up, getting ready to start the day, and I'm getting ready to do my normal routine um, that I do every morning before, I, you know, the kids normally are supposed to get up around this time um, for school, but they've been on really odd schedules, some weird school schedules and shit like that. And um, so right before they get up, I normally give me some water <laughs> when I first wake up. I'm not even going to lie to you. But um, I do my workout routine in the morning and I try to have them out of the fucking door. Um, but I try to smoke my dope too. <laughs> I try to smoke my dope before they get up. So I can be medicated throughout the morning and then normally I get myself ready for my reads. So that's what I'm doing. I'm heating up my warm water. I'm getting ready to make some chai tea. As you guys can hear, my voice is like on some March Simpson shit, but um, I'm getting ready to do my morning workout, my morning routine. And that's what I'll be showing you guys as I am um, rolling my reefer. I will be sipping my drink this morning, which is going to be some warm chai tea. And um, then I'm going to do some glute workouts, I think, um, and do some cardio. So, I'm getting ready to roll the weed, prepare for that, and get all my headphones and earbuds and all that shit together. But I have a bag, so like, this bag is my morning bag. It's got my vitamins in it that I take every morning. I also make sure I have fruit every morning. Things like that. It's got my workout gloves. And uh, where I hold my phone. It's been used the fuck up. I'm gonna have to get a new one because bitch been outside doing all kinds of shit with it. But Normally, this is my routine, so I'm going to show you guys a little bit of that. And after I roll this weed up, I'm going to smoke this shit before these kids get up. And, um, and smoke this weed, and <laughs> that's all I got on my mind. I drink this tea, and I'm going to do, I think I'm going to do a glute workout, and then some 10-minute uh, cardio. Um... I normally try to do like Afro beats, so like while I'm listening to it. Mm. Well, that's what I'm doing this morning. I'm trying to wake up. <laughs> All right, I'll see you guys in the next clip. Okay, honey. 
I got my chai tea. I put some whipped cream on top. Mmm. Cinnamons. And I got my blood. Okay. <laughs> so I'm about to sit this down. Just like so. Mmm, mmm, mmm. I stopped drinking coffee a long time ago. Um, I've been drinking teas every morning. But I feel better now that I drink um, tea, especially herbal tea, green teas. Y'all hear me order Starbucks on my videos. So I'm getting ready to smoke this. Get my music going. Watch these bitches on YouTube. Drain me. Mm -hmm. And then I'll have to get in the shower. Get the kids ready. For school. And uh, then. After that. I start all the tarot readings. All this shit that happens to me. In the beginning of the, like, the, beginning of the day. People hit me up usually early morning. Especially from different, uh, especially from different times. So, I love my job, y'all. And I love Mary Jane. So, I'm going to start that. And I'll see you guys after I finish this drink.